Ah, I'm so stupid. Treated him macam ni. He requested to be my friend, and I thought, why not, kan? Dia macam cute, so I feel like nothing can happen online, right? Lepas tu, dia start to like my picture, give nice comments. Over the next two months, he did all the right things. He really gets me, and he makes me feel so special. Dia memang pandai ambil hati saya. We started talking about our future together. Dia cakap dia kerja dekat Hong Kong and made plans to come here for my birthday and see if dia boleh cari kerja dekat sini lah. So on my birthday, I received a call saying that there was a problem with a package from Dan. Apparently, I have to pay some tax first for a jewellery package. Kena bayar duit, then only they can release. Lepas tu, Jabatan Kastam pula call I. They said if tax is not paid, then we'll have problem at the airport. So I checked the number online and the number was real. Nombor tu memang nombor Jabatan Kastam. Rupanya, I kena tipu. There was no jewellery. The scammers used VOIP, duplicated the actual phone number of Jabatan Kastam and tricked me into paying RM28,000. Then disappeared. Dihilang macam tu je. It was all a scam. I'm so hurt. He broke my heart. I feel so used. Beware, be aware. Stay safe online. Avoid suspicious friend requests. And remember, government agencies and authorities do not settle outstanding payments over the phone.